now use this splint for the movement of internal and external rotation connect the splint to the machine head in this way and tighten the screws now place the patient's hand in this way and tighten the belts now you are ready for the treatment switch on the power button and set the splint angle the process of the remote control is same for all the movements this is the movement of internal and external rotation for the movement of this internal and external rotation you need to change the position of the machine head for this loosen the screws using the allen key remove the machine head and place it horizontally in this way and then tighten the screws tighten it using the allen key in such a way that the machine should not move any further use this splint for the internal and external rotation attach this splint over here on the machine head in this way and tighten it using the knob now place the patient's patient's hand in this way and tighten it using the belts now set the required angle and treatment time in the remote same like other movements and press next so that the treatment starts in this way